Hi, I'm Dr. Anirudh from Toothpick Dental Healthcare. I'm a director and a dental surgeon at Toothpick Dental Healthcare, Fourth Block, Jayanagar, Bangalore. Inability to open the mouth. There are multiple reasons why we have inability to open the mouth. So let me start off with the first one. When you have your third molar extraction done or disimpaction done. So when you have that done, what is going to happen is it is going to cause a swelling that is quite intense and it is going to cause a muscle spasm in that region where the extraction has been done. So what happens when this extraction spasm happens that the patient will have a little bit of difficulty in opening the mouth for a couple of days. So ideally we tell that the space between the upper and the lower incisal edge should be at least three finger in length so that the that is the adequate mouth opening. So if it is not there then that is something that we need to address. What is the other reason that could possibly have be because of you know the inability to open the mouth. In case if you have a temporomandibular joint problem that is the TMJ problem maybe you have an ankylosis that is a fusion of the joint and the bone together and there is a restriction of the mouth opening or there was a trauma okay trauma related uh, difficulty in mouth opening okay or there is some kind of muscle issue or a muscle spasm that has taken place where the patient is unable to open the mouth uh, in precancerous condition like oral submucous fibrosis there is fibrosis of your muscles so the bands of fibers are formed inside making it even more difficult the elasticity reduces making it difficult to open the mouth and there are multiple other reasons and you know factors which will lead to a uh, decreased mouth opening so how we treat it, it totally depends upon what kind of problem the patient is facing in case of uh, patients with extraction can't open it we generally ask them to have some ferment hot water fermentation kind of give some exercises to open and things like that in tmj problem or in ankylosis problem still we have some exercises for them to do we have certain treatment that we would have to do and get them to you know a bite properly and have their bite corrected so on and so forth and in case of uh, osmf that is oral submucous fibrosis a precancerous condition we also have some treatment but it starts from counseling it starts from certain localized medication application of gel so on and so forth resulting in improvement of mouth opening so uh, to understand mouth opening it's a very vast subject it's a very vast subject and it's not that within i mean every case is a very serious reason why a person cannot open the mouth so therefore whenever you have difficulty opening the mouth visit your dentist find out what the problem is and get it solved when it is in a very basic level